We all know supercars to be the menacing, futuristic, outrageously handsome vehicles they are. Which is why when they turn out ugly, their hideousness leaves an even greater impression on us. Even manufacturers like Lamborghini and Bugatti have put together some seriously disgusting monsters in pursuit of perfection. Monsters you couldn't even afford if you wanted to. So since we're all clearly fed up with staring at an endless buffet of beautiful cars, let's instead look at five ugly supercars you can't even afford. All right, you've been warned. Number five, Weber Faster One. $1.4 million. Looking like a Bugatti that's undergone cheap plastic surgery, Weber's Swiss-built Faster One may well be one of the most grotesque supercars you ever lay eyes on. And at $1.4 million, it doesn't come cheap either. But although there is enough ugliness here to feed 10,000, it's actually one of the fastest street-legal sports cars in the world. The two-seater weighs in at just 2,452 pounds and is powered by a heavily modified 7-liter twin-supercharged V8 LS7 engine from General Motors that produces a staggering 900 horsepower and a top speed of, wait for it, 300.7 miles per hour. Thank goodness this car is as fast as it is fugly. That way, you'll almost always see its taillight and can afford being blinded by that god-awful wavy mustache for a car grill. Number 4. Covini C6W $640,000 To be fair, there's nothing wrong with its bodywork, but the extra set of wheels on this Covini have it looking like it just crawled out of a river in the Chernobyl exclusion zone. But if you can look past its ugliness, the Covini actually produces a fun 434 horsepower and a top speed of 186 miles per hour. However, the funniest part about the C6W is that it's not even a six-wheel drive car. Rather, it sends power to only four wheels. And although experts speculate those extra wheels may actually be hindering the car's performance, the Italians who built it say the extra wheels do give more front-end grip and better braking. Who cares, really? It's not like anyone's going to trade in looks for a little extra braking power. And even if they did want to buy it, with a sales price of $640,000, they'd be dishing out over $100,000 for each of those questionable wheels. Real quick, let's see if you can subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications in less than 5 seconds. Ready? Go! 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Did you make it? Awesome. Number 3. Mitsuoka Orochi $183,000 Shield your children's eyes, because this angry looking hood makes the Mitsuoka Orochi look like a character out of the movie Cars, only on steroids. In fact, it's likely Disney's CGI team did a better design job designing their cars than this real-life car manufacturer. And unfortunately, all it takes is a quick look at its wavy rear wing to see that it doesn't get much better from behind either. Truthfully, the only thing that's pretty about this car is its almost $184,000 price tag. And unlike some other cars on this list, the Orochi doesn't even make up for its ugliness with any significant performance. It uses the same 3.3-liter V6 seen in Toyota Camrys, which reaches a maximum output of 233 horsepower and a top speed of 155 miles per hour. Sure, it's above average, but that's not nearly enough torque to make up for the fact that they've committed just about every design sin possible. There's really no reason to buy this car, unless your goals was to specifically buy the ugliest car known to mankind. Number 2. Yamaha OX99-11 $1.3 million is that a hammerhead shark or a bottlenose dolphin on wheels? Oh wait, it's a Yamaha. If you've ever wondered why big-name sports bike manufacturers rarely take a crack at cars, the perplexing 0x99-11 is your answer. But what it may lack in appearance, it makes up for with unmeasurable performance. The 2,535-pound 0x99-11 uses a Formula One-derived 3.5-liter V12 engine that produces up to 400 horsepowers at a stratospherically high 10,000 RPM. 
Unfortunately, it went over budget. So Yamaha passed on its concept car to Ypsilon Technology and Milton Keynes. But the cost of the project had climbed so much and perceived demand was so low, it was eventually shut down for good. However, three of the cars exist today, and one of them is now reportedly for sale for $1.3 million. But if you're really into Yamahas, you're probably better off saving the money and saving face by getting a bike instead. Number 1. Lamborghini Egoista $117 million Say what you will about Lamborghini and their stunning designs, but this Gallardo-based futuristic V10 is about as gentle on the eyes as sulfuric acid. The company's Egoista supercar costs an astronomical 117 million US dollars, and it's not because of the custom paint job. The supercar is apparently made from the same anti-radar material used on fighter planes, and its bodywork houses aerodynamic panels that change height depending on downforce and stability. The one-seater was in fact modeled after a fighter jet, and with its incredibly chiseled aerodynamic body, quite literally looks like it's about to take off. Under its orange protective dome, it even features a cockpit the driver must climb in and out of instead of using a standard door. All it needs now is an ejector seat in case any of your friends catch you driving around in this hideous vehicle. And that's it for today's video. We hope that, if anything, these failures serve their purpose by at least giving you a good laugh. Which of these failed experiments would you never want to be seen driving? Let us know in the comments below. Oh, and if you like this video, you're definitely going to want to check out Inside the Rocks Car Collection.